Hey friends, come pack with me for a one month trip in Europe. Yes, you literally heard that I'm going to Europe! so excited so this is kind of like a pack with me slash my capsule wardrobe for the whole month and i'm going to talk you guys through all the different pieces that i'm going to be bringing with me to europe so firstly i have this pajama set i thought this would be so comfy as a pajama set to wear to bed but also to wear during the day sometimes because i know it's going to be winter in europe right now i think this is so comfy i love this so much i literally look like a bear with the hood on I love it so much. I just think this would be so nice with the coat on top and then scarves. I, of course, am going to be bringing so many thermals. I have this one thermal from Uniqlo. I bought it four times because I just think it's going to keep me so, so warm and so comfy. This one is the extra warmest one that they have on Uniqlo. I will link everything down below. Of course, if I bought it recently, if I bought it a while ago, it's probably sold out. I also have this one thermal. I bought this for when I went down to Melbourne in May. It's not as warm as the other one, but it really does do a good job in keeping the heat inside me so of course i'm gonna bring this one and then i bought this other one also in may when i went to go down to melbourne it is the thinnest sort of like a uh, thermal that i have um it's not super super warm but you know it could be good for sleeping or anything like that so i kind of have a color palette i think to make a capsule wardrobe and to make it look really really good so that i can just wake up and sort of choose my outfits really easily without having to think so much i came up with a color palette for this whole trip i mainly lean towards blacks whites creams and grays everything is very very neutral i do have a little bit of color but it's kind of all within the same color range if that makes sense such as this i also bought another thermal from uniqlo this is a turtleneck though um so i bought it not just in black not just in white but also in cream i actually love this the only thing i don't love about it is that it's not skin tight it's quite flappy on the arms but because it's a layering piece i'm not gonna worry too much about this one if you live in europe or have visited recently how cold is it be brutally honest i'm not gonna tell you guys exactly where i'm going i am just gonna keep it a secret for now and you're gonna see all the vlogs and tiktoks that i post make sure if you want to keep up to date to follow me on my tiktok and instagram i'm gonna be posting outfit of the days every single day and little vlogs every single day but i will also be posting some youtube content as well now you may see this and be like ivy you're crazy for bringing a skirt to europe right now actually please let me know if i am crazy bringing a skirt to europe right now i do have these fleece tights though i have like at least two pairs of these and leg warmers as well and i think wearing them like this would still keep me super warm please let me know though if like this is absolutely so wrong and i'm just gonna freeze to death obviously i'm gonna be layering with lots of um knits and sweaters and then my coat on top so yeah let me know if packing these skirts are a waste of space i just think this would be so cute though and honestly i don't know how realistic it will be that i am gonna be wearing an outfit like this because even in brisbane winter i get so so cold really easily so who knows because i'm not telling you guys where i'm going in europe i want you guys to comment down below which countries i will be visiting i'll be visiting at least six different countries and if you have any recommendations in any country let me know down below as i mentioned my color palette is very neutral so i only brought four pairs of pants i have these white like sort of I don't know what to call these these are like tailored pants work pants i also bought one of these tailored slash work pants in black as well white and black are so timeless i think they will literally go with anything one of the main things that i think about when packing a capsule wardrobe of course is to always think about what will be easiest to pick an outfit with in the morning i last went to europe in 2015 in winter as well and, and i remember bringing pairs of jeans but i remember never wearing them ever the cold just absolutely cut through the jeans so bad and so i'm not bringing any jeans at all in this trip just these kind of work pants so we're moving on to the knits that i brought i think this looks very festive and very cool it's a really cool turtleneck which i will definitely be using those turtlenecks to layer underneath to keep me super extra warm this is my trusty sweater i bought this in melbourne earlier this year and i wore this relentlessly throughout winter because it is so warm i just think it'll be a great sleeping piece or even just to wear in general i love it it's like drake with a little nike tick on it i'm pretty sure this is illegal to sell but you know someone did in a random market in melbourne and they get away with it i'm also bringing this striped sweater this one's a bit thin i don't know if i'm gonna wear it very often as the actual sweater but because i see a lot of striped clothing as parisian clothing inspo i of course had to bring a striped sweater i'm gonna be wearing it on top of my coats or sweaters like this of course i was also gonna show you guys what it looks like this is what it looks like maybe i could get away with like layering a couple of thermals underneath this but we will see i'm moving on to the cream and caramel colored pants that i have i have this more darker i don't know what color this is like olive 
brownish almost this one fits me really really well and cuts off at my ankles really really well which would be great because i know it snows and or rains a lot in different various european countries so i think this will be really really good i do have these caramel pair of pants um they are a little bit long on me but that's okay i kind of like the really baggy look anyways especially when i wear sneakers it kind of looks like a cool streetwear kind of style i really love these pants because they go with the next few sweaters that i'm going to show you guys so i have this one fluffy teddy bear one i just think this is so cute and i think will actually keep me really really warm i feel like the colors of these two go so well and honestly the monochromatic look just is so timeless all the time this is the last sweater i have i think this is such a cool statement piece this is kind of the most out there piece that i'm bringing that i've shown you guys as you can see it's quite colorful but again i think it'll pair well with any of the pants that i'm bringing with me and this is why i I have added it to my capsule wardrobe. For outerwear, I'm only really bringing two pieces myself. I'm bringing this Nike puffer jacket. It's so good because it's fleece inside. The white is like this really, really nice warm fleece material. And then the black is like this waterproof material. You can also wear it reversible like this. It is so cool. And I just love that you can change this up however way you want. I also only brought one coat with me. I'm bringing this one. It's actually my friend's. I do not have the link for it, but she let me borrow it. I also feel like like chunky sweaters are really in trend right now so i have this one chunky scarf this one is from kmart and this other one from weekday i just love this one i just think it is honestly such a great length and color overall and it's really gonna help me with all my outfits like make it become more pinteresty i feel when you guys dress for winter are you guys just dressing for comfort or are you also trying to get that cool pinteresty vibe this is also another coat that i have this is my husband's coat he's also only bringing one puffer jacket and one coat as well i thought i would interchange my coat with this coat so it can kind of like switch it up every now and then um i think it works really well because this one fits me and it's a really cool oversized look it'll go with so many of my outfits as well i also lastly brought these pair of earmuffs i think these are so cute Cute. I love them so much and onto accessories. This is my husband's bag. Of course again I'm gonna steal it every now and then it is just this body bag really easy So I don't have to bring a backpack everywhere I go with me. I also have this other bag I really don't think this is real Gucci um, One of Ani's family members gave it to us and I just thought it'd be really cool to wear it like this Again interchange it with different outfits as I go out every single day and of course, I'm going to bring a big backpack with me. And when it comes to shoes, I'm only going to bring the very basics. Of course, my sneakers. There's going to be so much walking when we go over there. So I'm definitely trying to go for comfort. I'm bringing one pair of sunnies just in case I really needed it. And that is my capsule wardrobe for the one month that I'm traveling. I hope you guys like this video and uh, can draw some kind of inspo from it. Like this video if you really liked it. Give it a thumbs up. Follow me on my Instagram and TikTok. It's at Ivy underscore Nicole with two E's. I will be keeping up to date with that every single day with my stories, posting outfit of the days, and posting little vlogs every single day. I hope you guys enjoy. Bye! Get it.